for the first method, you want to head over to search and then type in Task Manager. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to look for Epic Games Launcher. You might have to scroll down to find it, but once you find Epic Games Launcher, you want to right click on it and then click on End Task. Now for the second method, you want to head over to search and then type in Epic Games Launcher. You want to right click on it and then click on Open File Location. Now once you're on this, you want to right click on Epic Games Launcher again and then click on Properties. And then next to target, at the end, you just want to put a space and then you want to type in HTTP equals WinnieNet. I'm also going to leave this down below in the description so you can copy and paste it if you want and then click on OK and then click on Continue. Now for the next method, you want to head over to search and then type in Epic Games Launcher. Then you want to run it as administrator and then click on Yes and then see if this works for you. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search again and then type in CMD. Then you want to run it as administrator and then click on yes. Now once you're on this, we're going to type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS and click on enter. Then we're going to type in netsh space winsock space reset and click on enter again. Now once you complete this method, you want to restart your computer and then see if this fixes the problem for you. Now once you've restarted your computer, if the problem still persists, then you want to head over to search and then type in network reset. Click on it. Then you want to click on reset now and then click on yes. Now you want to restart your computer again and then that should fix the problem.